Hey guys, Wang Jolson here, and today I'll be telling a story. This story includes me, Wang Clark, Wang Abin, and another friend of mine, we'll just call him Calvin. The story began with my mom telling me to go feed the geese, because we have a pond in our backyard. And we got bored of this pretty quickly, so we just decided to go to the front of the neighborhood and chuck the bag of bread into a creek. And for some reason, being the dumb person that I am, I thought my mom would want this bag back. I have no idea why, because it was just a plain plastic bag. I mean, she couldn't really do anything with it. Anyway, after we retrieved the bag, we decided to explore the woods a little bit. And we came across this tunnel. And on one side of the tunnel, there was a muddy bank that we used to cross. I was the last person to cross, and as I was crossing, Wang Abin was climbing up this tree, and it was a really slippery, muddy bank, so I ended up falling in, and as I fell in, the tree that Wang Abin was on broke, so he ended up falling in too. After all of this, we decided to head back home, and I'd have my mom take us to another forest. I don't know what deal with forest was that day, I guess we were just into exploring. Anyway in this other woods that we wanted to go to there is this vine that i've been on a couple times where you could just swing on it and it was a lot of fun so we went to this other forest and i don't know it was pretty weird there's barbed wire everywhere and just random objects scattered all over the place so of course i was the first one to go on the vine just to show everyone how to do it and as I went on it, I instantly knew something was wrong, because the, the vine was dragging on the ground, and I that was not normal. And then when it got to the highest point, which is probably like 10 or 15 feet in the air, the vine started breaking, and I ended up falling straight on my back. Luckily, I wasn't injured or anything, but everyone was just laughing at that. And I probably would have too, it must have looked hilarious, but... So after that, we found these paint cans, and we were just spraying all the trees and stuff. I have no idea why, it's pretty dumb. But, after a bit of that, Wang Abin chucks the paint thing at a rock, and it explodes. And I have no idea why, but... This is another example of me being dumb. I for some reason thought that the gas coming out of the spray paint cans would kill us. So we all ran away. And eventually I realized, like, what the heck am I doing? This, we're fine. So after that, we explored the woods a little more, of course. And found more random things, like... It looked like there was almost a whole car down there. I... Maybe there's like a car accident in the forest somehow. That probably didn't happen, but anyway. Um, we saw these houses and we decided to go up to one. And the one house we went to, it was surrounded in barbed wire. And the, there was a lawnmower, like a tarp, and all this stuff, like right next to us. And after a little bit of just standing there and looking at all this stuff, this person came out, and to this day, I still have no idea if it was a man or a woman, a child or an adult. I, I just could not tell. And they just started yelling at us to, like, get off the property and what are you doing? And they were just freaking out at us. And eventually, we somehow calmed them down and, like, and they just completely changed moods and after yelling at us and just going crazy at it, on us they they just randomly out of nowhere just asked us if we went to Parkway Central it was just out of the blue I don't even know so we all just said no and then walked away and left them there and after that we went into, went to another woods by the pond in my backyard and nothing really interesting happened there I mean there was a rope that Wang Abin went on to swing across the creek but as we were leaving Wang Abin just chucked a rock into the air 
and I have no idea why, but none of us moved. We just stood there and covered our heads, which was the dumbest idea. We should have just ran away and got out of there. So then, this is where Calvin comes in. Calvin was the unlucky one. He got hit on the back of the neck, and it... It looked like he had just gotten shot, like he was, he was just in pain and he slowly fell over, but he ended up being okay. And so after all this, Calvin and I just went back to my backyard and we made slipping slip and slides out of garage bags. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching guys and I hope everyone has a wonderful day.